The Sayers family had a chilly basement. They had to cover themselves with blankets when watching their favorite DVDs. They read about insulation retrofit projects online and decided to make their basement space more comfortable. They hired the experienced renovation contractor team of Reg Monroe and Daryl Lindsay. How long have you been renovating? Uh, probably over 20 years of renovations. So you use the product, uh, I think, for the first time today. Uh, maybe tell us a little bit about how you like using it. Well, I, I like it because it's lightweight, cuts really easy, and it's clean. Oh, it's nice that it's a lot more flexible too than, yeah. uh, than conventional styrofoam Absolutely. insulation too, which b tends to break pretty easily when you, uh, when you bend it too far, but this stuff you can bend uh, like crazy around corners. Durofoam is Plastifab's newest insulation product, ideal for insulation retrofit projects. It is a film-faced rigid insulation with unique durable characteristics. Cover the entire floor area with a 6 mil polyethylene moisture barrier to eliminate moisture migration. Attach 1x3 strapping around the perimeter of the basement floor using self-tapping concrete screws or concrete nails. Real easy, real easy to work with. Sharpie felt pen and, uh, and uh, if you get one use a string line or a straight edge and just cut right through. That's one of the nicest things about this stuff is the, how easily it cuts. Cut the insulation to ensure that the strapping is on 24 inch centers. And it doesn't chip off. Like your corners, you bump a corner and, and it chips off. Now what do you do? What do you, what do, you do to fill that gap, right? This stuff you don't have to worry about. Be sure to use a suitable subfloor material, such as a wood sheeting panel with a marking of 1F24 to indicate a 24 inch span rating. Mark the wall where the 1x3 strapping centers intersect it to help locate the strapping when attaching the subfloor. Be sure to stagger the subfloor joints for extra stability. PL400, that's what's the most important part of a silent floor system. To do this in, in a basement setting is perfect. It, uh, you'll never get a squeak out of the floor. Apply adhesive to the strapping. Then, every eight inches, fasten the subfloor directly to the one by three strapping using either ring nails or deck screws. Your basement floor is now correctly insulated and ready for your final decorating touch. You will notice that the finished floor is now much more comfortable.